he sliced open his penis to prove a theory. In 1767, Surgeon John Hunter infected himself to settle a deadly debate. At the time, doctors thought gonorrhea and syphilis might be the same illness. Hunter was determined to prove it firsthand. How? He made cuts on himself and smeared infected pus from a patient directly onto the wounds. At first, symptoms of gonorrhea appeared, exactly as Hunter hoped. But soon after, syphilis took hold too. Convinced he was right, Hunter declared the two diseases were stages of the same illness, and the world believed him. But Hunter's patient had both infections all along. His experiment was horribly flawed from the start. For 50 years, medicine mistakenly believed gonorrhea and syphilis were one disease, all because of Hunter's gamble. John Hunter eventually died in 1793, possibly from the syphilis he had given himself. In 1838, French physician Philippe Ricord finally corrected the record. Gonorrhea and syphilis were different diseases. History is full of doctors doing disgusting things. Follow for more shocking medical mistakes you won't believe were real.